we've had an hour of sleep, and it's time to vote! So, I don't know if you guys know this, but I was a history major originally in college for like a whole year before I actually changed to poli sci and econ because I, I wanted to find a job a little, you know, after I graduated, so. Not a lot of jobs in history. I, I don't think so. I mean, there's it's a very particular route that you could go. Uh, but, but you feel I, like there's a lot more in poli sci and econ? Oh, econ, certainly. I bring this okay. up by, by a terrible segue of saying I get really sentimental this time of year. My family, I am a first-generation immigrant, the first-generation born here in the United States, so voting is very important to me. And the fact that we're standing at such a momentous time in history right now, I legitimately got teary earlier when I was voting today, that that we, we got to vote as, as a you and I, all of us, got to vote for the first black president of the United States, and today, hopefully, got to vote for the first female president of the United States. We are living in an amazing time right now just to be Americans as we are moving forward. There are young children right now who have never known a white male president. That's it's crazy to me. I mean, before this, what did people get to vote on? I mean, the first non-Virginian president of the United States. Hey, that was, was important. That was the big one. The first Catholic. I mean, we got to vote on the first black and the first, first <laughs> female president. Hopefully. It's an amazing time to be alive right now. So I thought... Ellie brought this game to us, and this is the time to play it right now. Uh, the voter suppression trail. Let's get right into it. Uh, okay. Sweet. I like it. It's uh... Oh, they're, they're going really for the Oregon Trail look. <laughs> the look and feel. Oh, it really is. <laughs> nice. Oh, yeah. No, we got to get right in here. Try your hand at voting in the world's greatest democracy. Will you endure hardships like long lines and voter intimidation? Or will you just take a leisurely stroll to your well staffed polling <laughs> place? <laughs> Many types of people attempt to vote in America. You may be a white programmer from California, a Latina nurse from Texas, or a black salesman from Wisconsin. Mm. Uh, let's go with the white programmer. I think so, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. From California. Here we go. Ooh. What is your name? That seems accurate. Yeah, no, that seems right. <laughs> All right. That, that is pretty close, yeah. Yeah, yeah. California, November 8th, 2016. The palm trees are, are pretty good, yeah. <laughs> it's a glorious place. day in Orange County. I want to stroll to my polling place. Stroll to your polling place, done. No. Oh, look, it, that even looks like me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, not really. Hardly a line. Look uh, at that. Yeah, no, we got to enter the polling place. Enter, yes. Enter the polling place. There's no frustration. Oh, I, I like had that. to wait a minute. Uh, I'm out. Uh, okay, so it uh, weather's pleasant, non-existent frustration. Minutes waited one. You want to enter the voting? Enter the vote. It, yeah, I want to choose that one. Okay, all right. Um, <laughs> are you, are you going to cast your vote, Doctor Frog? I love Frog? voting. I, I want to choose the one that I can cast my vote. Okay, yeah, no, all right, good. <laughs> hey, I won. <laughs> Congratulations, well Frog! You've guessed your vote! It's been a tough journey! See how your life was affected. <laughs> you waited one minute, so you became enraged zero times. Go to Mocker Go to Frog! <laughs> Alright. Well, that seems good. Yeah. Now, remember to get out there and actually vote. Good. This music! Oh, wow, that, that was a great <laughs> game, and I, I want to say I played it really well, um, but I want to give you guys a shot, so All right. let's I'm play gonna, again. I'm, let's play again. All right. Do I'm, you want to be the Latina? I, I'll be the Latina. Yeah, I'll be the Latina nurse from Texas. So I'm going to be a black salesman when it's my turn. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Do you want to be the Latina? Would, okay. would you prefer you to be, be the Latina the, nurse? You can be the Latina nurse. I'm just saying. Ellie. There's one woman here. Wow. Racism. <laughs> <laughs> Rampant racism. Will not be the black salesman. I just wanted to be the female Texas, character. November 8th, 2016. Wow, howdy, Texas. I could have sworn there were more polling sites in this here district. I'm going to take the bus across town. Okay, all right. Oh, my. <laughs> it's the people in line. <laughs> GOP tactics that cut back on polling places and workers are causing a huge lines. Do you want to sigh? I, I do. Okay, you want to I'm sigh. sighing, yeah. Right. Oh, my. Y'all better that? hunker down there. It's going to be a Ooh. short wait. Wait, what if my son has <laughs> dysentery? And good news, your son has dysentery. Okay. Will you leave the line and pick him up from school? 
He'll no. be fine. No, no, no. He'll be okay. You gotta vote. I mean, this is an important American institution, Ellie. All right, no, I'm sticking here. You I'm voting. You are a daughter of the American Revolution. <laughs> the this. school nurse holds me. Soldier on, muscle up. <laughs> Ooh, look, your butt is hot, <laughs> and your frustration is rising. The bull workers here do not know how to operate <laughs> the machines properly. Lose twenty minutes. Oh, oh my. Oh God. I. My, my son is probably dying at home with the dysentery right now. It's time to pick up your daughter from daycare. Will you leave the line? Uh, I mean... No, no, no. No, no, no. They'll keep her for uh, for 15 minutes after before they really start to get upset. Uh, all right. No, no, no. This is important. I'm going to vote. This is important. Yeah. The daycare center charges your credit oh! card for being late. No. But this is important. I'm now broke and frustrated. Your child calls you crying for help. Will you leave the line? Oh, God! <laughs> I mean... <laughs> no, no, this is really important. No, I have to vote. Not leaving the line. You're a horrible mother. And your child thinks you don't care about them at all. <laughs> They're probably right. Your frustration has gone to teeth grinding, by the way. I I've been in line for... A hundred oh, minutes? The dirge that's going on currently is crazy. Oh, God, there are red guys. There are oh. guys in red hats. <laughs> and they are looking at you funny. Do you, do you want to avoid eye contact? God, or? yes, I do. <laughs> Election observers are stalking the halls looking for suspicious individuals. Don't let them intimidate you. Avoid being hit by their insults and angry rhetoric. Oh, shit, is this a mini game that we have to play now? Oh, oh my god! <laughs> Need arrow keys. Arrow keys, thank you. Arrow keys, uh, yeah. Okay. Did you want to do this? No, 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 it's, it's all you. It's no. all B, okay. We're, we're running. Oh god! No! <laughs> Don't get hit by their insults. Dodge the insults. Oh no! No! I'm afraid the threat of physical harm at the polls and other scare tactics have been new since before Jim Crow and have recently been called for by GOP candidates. I'm sorry, Ellie. Here in this ground lies Ellie's vote. Aww. Voter intimidation still works. Now remember to get out there and actually vote on November 8th. We'll see you in line. Okay. My, my vote didn't didn't happen. Uh, you know, you're a I bad American. My... I know. Wanna... Did you see how much better an American I am than you? <laughs> I wanted this game. You failed. And Daughter of the Revolution, indeed. My my children got dysentery yeah. and like and left don't and love you anymore. And they don't love me. You have and no yeah, money I didn't anymore. Even vote. You got charged for the daycare cost. Okay, I'm gonna be a black salesman from Wisconsin. All right, let's see it. Okay. <laughs> that seems right. Yeah. No. <laughs> Wisconsin, November eighth. Frigid Wisconsin. Oh shit! Is it cold in Wisconsin? Oh, that's a good right point. Now? There's, it's there's November, winter yeah. in Wisconsin uh, right now. Okay. Now it's I'll, time. I'll take a bus. Sure. All right. All right. Oh my. Oh wait, what? <laughs> Got a, a little bit of a line as well. It appears Who can do a good Wisconsin? Anyone? <laughs> 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 hey there, Margie. It appears that the GOP's voter fraud initiatives are causing major lines at the polls. Ugh. <laughs> oh dear, it's a little brisk today. <laughs> oh no, your boss is angry that you're not back yet. Will you leave the line and go back to work? No, no, this is important. It's an American institution. Your boss grumbles something about Trump and docks your pay. Wait, what? That's un-American. And I think but you're an hourly illegal. worker. Oh, I'm sorry. Our district couldn't afford new machines. You'll lose 20 minutes. Oh, oh my. Okay. Uh, br brisk. That's that's cold, right? Nope. Chilly it, now. It just got chilly. Oh, my. Your boss left an angry voicemail, instructing you to get back. Will you leave the line and get back to work? I've only been gone for an hour. Uh, no. No, no, no. We have to soldier on. Your boss cancels your next three shifts. Holy. <laughs> what? I feel like you're going to be broke at the end of this election. Uh, or frozen. I don't know that you're going to make it. Your, <laughs> your co-worker is dysentery and needs you to cover for him. Will you leave the line to help a friend? No, no, no. This is the easiest one, I feel like. I don't like that guy anyway. He dislikes you intensely. Ah, it's okay. I'm not going to be working the next three shifts anyway. <laughs> you're being pelted with freezing rain. What? Will you leave the line? 
or stay in here and die of pneumonia. There's no freezing rain in California. I don't know how to deal with this. No. <laughs> You put your numb hands in your pockets and hope you won't be too sick for oh, work tomorrow. Well, my, my next three shifts are canceled, so I don't need to worry about that. That's the way to think about it. Oh, no. Okay. You have uh -oh. the intimidation coming, too. Uh, oh, no. Those guys in the hats must be election observers I was reading about. Uh, avoid eye contact. They're looking for suspicious individuals. Don't let them intimidate you. Okay. You better avoid their insults and angry rhetoric. I've got it this time. Here lies Eagles! <laughs> Vote. Voter intimidation tactics still work. Well, I, so I, I think we've learned something very valuable from this. Yeah, I think we Live have in California? I am a better American than all of you. <laughs> I think the most important thing that we've learned today is please get out there and vote today. If you like this game, it was created by the New York Times. You can play it. It's a web-based game. You can play it off there. And we'll make sure to leave a link in the description. Thanks. I'm turning all the old people to hot dogs, and you're next. <laughs> the flying hell is going on. <laughs> well, that sounds like a great plan. The world needs hot dogs. Oh, son, stop him. Why are you so 